Hey guys, Justin here and welcome. Now what I've got to do today is sort this bathroom ceiling out. As you can see, it's all started flaking away. It's looking pretty nasty. I need to sort it out. Now I'm guessing that the ceiling wasn't sealed properly and of course because it's in the bathroom there is a lot of moisture. Um, so my plan is scrape that, all that paint off, seal it, PVA it and give it a couple of coats of paint afterwards. So uh, let's get cracking. <laughs> So you can see that the paint has peeled away, um, it's all gone crispy and coming off with my fingertips. So we just go ahead and scrape that all off, trying to get off as much as possible. Um, really want to make sure don't leave any flaky bits on there whatsoever. I'm using a really sharp scraper here, so it's really enabling me to get underneath that flaking paint. So once I've got all the paint off with the scraper, I do need to make sure I sand it. Um, this is going to be to blend it in so there's not an obvious line where the paint was and the plasterboard is. There we go, that's all scraped and sanded, so we're now ready to PVA it. So I've mixed up some PVA with uh, three parts water approximately, um, one part PVA, three parts water, and just painting over the whole area. So not just where the plasterboard is showing, but over that whole area where it gets quite damp and lots of moisture around, uh, around the shower area. So there you go, that's all PVA'd and sealed now. Just going to leave that for a little while and then we can start getting some paint on it. So the PVA is dry to the touch now so I'm going to go ahead and get some paint on the ceiling and on this first coat really just focusing on going over the areas where you can actually see the plaster. Now that that first coat has had enough time to dry, I'm now going over um, and applying a second coat. So just cutting in uh, with a brush and just to give it a nice even effect all over, I'm using a small roller, a mini roller. And I'm making sure that I cover that whole area this time. So not just going over the patches of plaster, but actually that whole area above the shower.
And there you go, there's the finished product. So there we go, all done. Good job, I'm happy with that. Really looks good. Um, the client did only want it patched up, so I have only done that small area. Otherwise the whole thing would have taken me a, a lot longer. But uh, I'm happy, job done. Hopefully it's not gonna start peeling again. So uh, fingers crossed there. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video, hope it's helped, and um, don't forget to subscribe, leave any comments or questions below, and I'll see you on the next video.